Imagine standing on the edge of a life-changing decision. Your dream job, starting your own business, moving to a new city, but something is holding you back. That something is fear. We've all been there. Fear has this sneaky way of keeping us stuck, preventing us from taking the big risks that could lead to our greatest rewards. But what if you could stop letting fear control your decisions? Hey, I'm Mash Ponigala, and today we're diving deep into one of the most common challenges we all face, overcoming fear to take those big, bold risks that can transform our lives. Whether it's fear of failure, fear of judgment, or fear of the unknown, these feelings are powerful, but they don't have to hold you back. We'll explore five advanced strategies to help you conquer your fears and keep confidently moving into the unknown. First, let's talk about reframing fear as excitement. Did you know that the physiological response to fear is almost identical to that of excitement? Your heart races, your palms sweat, and of course your mind sharpens. The key difference lies in how you interpret those sensations. The next time you feel fear come creeping in, tell yourself that what you're feeling is excitement. This simple reframe can transform your mindset from one of dread to one of anticipation. By viewing fear as a signal that something exciting is about to happen, you can start to see risk-taking as an adventure rather than a threat that you should be afraid of. Next, harness the power of visualization. This isn't just about daydreaming. It's a scientifically backed method used by athletes, entrepreneurs, and high performers to overcome fear and achieve their goals. Okay, so close your eyes and vividly imagine yourself taking the risk and succeeding. See it in detail, how it feels, what you hear, what you see. The brain cannot distinguish between a vividly imagined event and reality. So by visualizing success, you're training your mind to believe that it's possible. When fear starts to hold you back, revisit this visualization. It'll reinforce your confidence and make the risk feel more manageable. It's like climbing a mountain one step at a time. Now the peak may be daunting, but if you just focus on the next step before you know it, you will have made significant progress. But what if fear is so paralyzing that even small steps feel impossible? That's where the next strategy comes in. One that has the potential to completely change your relationship with fear. This technique is known as exposure therapy. It's used in psychology to help people confront and overcome their fears. The idea is simple. Gradually expose yourself to what you fear in a controlled, deliberate way. Start small and increase the level of exposure over time. By facing your fears in incremental steps, you desensitize yourself to the fear and you build resilience. The more you expose yourself to the fear, the less power it has over you. Eventually, what once seemed terrifying becomes manageable and you're able to take those big risks with confidence. Finally, surround yourself with risk takers. There's a reason why entrepreneurs, athletes, and artists often seek out like-minded individuals. They understand the power of influence. When you're around people who are constantly pushing their limits, their, their courage and mindset starts to rub off on you. You begin to see risk-taking as the norm rather than the exception. Seek out mentors, peers, or communities where big risks are celebrated and encouraged. Their energy will help you push through your fears and take bold steps towards your goals. So how do you stop letting fear hold you back from taking big risks? Reframe your fear as excitement. Visualize your success. Break down the risk into manageable steps. Practice exposure therapy and surround yourself with risk takers. All right, I will see you in the next video.